Nelson Rodriguez from KDSMallsUSA.com. We're going to be talking today about the tips and tricks on the Nova 450 helicopter. It, this is no design that KDS bring in the market around four to six years ago. Very good model, very simple, it's, it's very affordable setup. Um, I believe right now the whole set are completely stuck with the servos and the EVAR. It's around less than 400 bucks. Um, so it's I believe it's very reasonable price for a 450 size helicopter that flies very well out of the box um, this is my tips and tricks if you fly hard 3d I did just basically two modifications very simple first one is um, I pin my rear tail case here as you can see I, I just drill a little hole here basically um, put a screw there is I believe it's a two millimeter screw very simple the second modification that I did in mind was um, my tail push rod. I basically I grabbed the stock one and I cut it in half, and I glue it inside of, of a solid uh, on a carbon rod. Um, that way my uh, tail pusher doesn't flex on flight and hard maneuvers. Very simple. It's, it's, that's the only two modifications that I did in this model and flies very very well. Um, tips that I want to recommend you guys is here in the in the washout. The stock bowling is like in the second hole, so I what I did in mind to get more pitch and the best geometry for 3D is move it all the way out. That way my links you can see is perfectly straight and I have more pitch when this servo moves. Um, my setup right now, I'm running a, a Glacier 30C 2200 pack. Very simple setup, flies very well. Um, my, geomet my servo resolution is in the, the stock arms, is the second hole from the inner to the outer to out, is the second hole and the first hole in the tail on the tail servo. Right guys, I'm going to give you my um, setup on the EVAR. Uh, again, um, this is my personal preference for you can be different, so what I recommend you is to play with the settings and get it to your taste. But for my fly style, my setup right now on the 
on the e bar is on control i have zero exponential around 15 on cyclic 12 on the tail on the radio on the dr pitch acceleration 24 fly bar field 27 um this is on the controls and fly mode right now i fly on vivid 66 on the bar gain and motion i have it on 92 tail adjustment okay travel clockwise and counterclockwise 52 and 46 turn it back all right gyro gain i have it on 69 jaw raise 100 and the dr i lower down to 95 that way my tail rotation is to my taste on the on the speed um exponential again zero i run 12 on the tail on the dr on the radio acceleration i have 58 stop clockwise and counterclockwise 20 clockwise 23 percent right guys this is my setup for the um for the EVAR on the 415 Nova. Alright guys, this is Nelson Rodriguez. I hope uh, this video was helpful for you guys. If you have any questions, please email me through nail3d.com. There you can contact me for any questions about setup or any question that you have about the KDS Agile helicopters or the Innova series. Alright, take care.